All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Raiders Daily, where we post daily Las Vegas Raiders content. If that's something you enjoy, enjoy this video. Be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Getting closer and closer to 2,000 subscribers, so if you guys are new here, appreciate the new support. A little late on this one, oh, just a little late, you know, two words you never really want to hear. Um, Stanford Samuels III out of Florida State University. I love the signing. I absolutely love the signing. So basically right now, I mean, pretty much all across the league, you have guys uh, being signed and, you know, teams are kind of trying to fill out the rest of their roster. You know, you're seeing some free agency moves. You know, you're seeing some undrafted free agents being signed. You know, you're seeing all of it right now. So Stanford Samuels the third, um, Dude, this guy's a freaking dog. I am really actually hopeful about this guy. I don't usually make too many videos on, you know, kind of low-key signings unless I really mess with the dude. Uh, we have a little excerpt here from Sports Illustrated. So Samuels III originally was signed by the Green Bay Packers as an undrafted free agent in 2020. He's currently 23 years old. Only played two games, spent most, most of the season on the practice squad. Uh, but he went to Florida State, like I mentioned, and he had eight picks in 37 games. So, you know, I don't know what the Raiders are, you know, I don't know what the Raiders are going to do at the cornerback position if they're just completely done or if they're, you know, chilling with what they got. Obviously, I like, you know, Anthony, I like Rock, um, you know, you're kind of trying to fill the hole of Casey Hayward, but this is, I think this is underrated right here. You know, I'm really hoping that he's able to make the squad and actually get some playing time because, you know, what stands out for me from him as opposed to you know, some of the other Raiders free agent signings or as opposed to, you know, undrafted free agents um, from this year's draft is that he has actual playing time, right? So he's been in the league for two seasons now. Um, yeah, he's only played in two NFL games, but that's two more NFL games than any rookie right now. So, you know, that's kind of the thing, especially with undrafted rookies is, you know, these are more long-term plays. Like, we're trying to fill out the practice squad. Um, you know, you're trying to take gambles because they're all very low risk, high reward. So, you know, if you get even just like one undrafted free agent signing or, you know, even just one kind of home run free agent, like a low key free agent, that's really good. So we'll see what Stanford can bring to this squad. But this guy plays with a gritty demeanor and he knows he's the he, he knows he's that guy. Like, he knows he's that guy. So I love just his energy. I love his vibe. I feel like it fits the Raiders perfectly. And uh, I hope he finds a long-term home here, man. So, you know, let me know what you guys think about this down below. Quick little video for you guys. Hit the like button. Hit that sub button, as always. And, yeah, drop a comment down below. Peace.